So, picture this, the iconic Roloff family farm, where they host their famous pumpkin season tour every year, is back on the market. Yep, you heard it right. Matt Roloff, the family patriarch, had previously listed the farm for a cool $4 million, but then he had a change of heart and decided to turn it into an Airbnb rental. However, it seems like that plan didn't quite go as expected, and now the property is up for sale again, but this time at a lower price of $3,395,000. What's going on here? Is there a family feud behind the scenes? Now, you might be wondering, what's the deal with this family feud? Well, let me tell you, it's no small matter. Matt's two older sons, Jeremy and Zach, have been at odds with him. Jeremy moved into a fancy $1.5 million farm with his wife Audrey, just a short drive away from the Roloff farm. But despite the proximity, Jeremy decided not to show up during the pumpkin season, the busiest time for the family. Ouch. That's got to sting. But wait, there's more. Zach, on the other hand, had his own beef with dear old dad. He and his wife Tori offered to buy a portion of the family farm, but Matt declined their offer, leading to a nasty feud between them. Zach was so disenchanted that he decided not to work the pumpkin season, stepping away from the family business. Talk about tension in the family. And as for the youngest son, Jacob, well, he's been making some interesting choices. He moved into a camper home with his wife Isabel on a private property near the Roloff farm. They're living there to save money and help out on the farm, which sounds like a crafty plan. But could there be more to this story? Are they staying close by until the farm finds a buyer? But amidst all the family drama, there's something else that came to light. Matt's five-year-old grandson, Gideon, has been going through some challenges. Joanna Duggar, a family friend, revealed that Gideon has a genetic condition affecting his learning, and she's putting in the effort to get him the right help. It's heartwarming to see how families support each other during tough times. All right, my lovely audience, I know we've covered a lot today, and I want to hear your thoughts. Drop your comments below, and let's get the discussion going. What do you think about the family farm going back on the market? Do you have any predictions for the future of the Roloff clan? Share it all, I can't wait to read your views. And hey, if you enjoyed this juicy update and want to stay in the loop with the latest news and gossip about your favorite stars and TV shows, hit that like button and make sure to subscribe to my channel. We've got plenty more exciting content coming your way, and I don't want you to miss a thing. Alright, folks, that's a wrap for today. Remember to spread the love, and until next time, this is Max signing off. Peace out, my amazing viewers.